welcome back to another weekly vlog. It's your girl Julie Shabit, and we here to get my hair done today by the one and only. Y'all already know who it is. Y'all wanna see who it is? She mad. She gotta do my hair. I don't know why you mad, girl. Don't be mad. Don't be mad. <laughs> so I'm gonna get some um, knowledge braids. And after this, basically this is gonna be like a kind of maintenance vlog because I'm going on vacation in a couple of days. So I'm trying to get all my things out the way. So we got hair, which is gonna be knowledge braids. We got pedicure, nails, cause what is this? Brows. And I'm not doing I'm not doing lashes because I'm going to like I'm just I'm I'm just not a lash extension girl. I'm a strip girl, so and then that's it. So let's see how my braids come out. I did get some Chipotle earlier and she already washed my hair. I used the Art Naturals clarifying shampoo and conditioner. I'll show it to y'all. It's really good. You go sit on my TikTok. It's this one. Really moisturizing. Like, do you see the curls? Like, this is like straight. Like, she pinned it up. This is like straight. Just shampoo and conditioner. No product or nothing. So, I think it's cute. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. She rushing me so bad. I was like, just let me start my vlog, girl. You don't know what love is. Okay, so let's get started. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, y'all. So this is how my hair turned out yesterday. Like, it came out really cute, right? Like, I wanted medium to large knowledge braids. And that's exactly what I got. Um, and I know I said that I wasn't going to do no lashes, but my sister just like put these on. They're like the, Ar no, they're the Kiss Clusters and she's like some Ardell glue. So honestly, it's not going to last. It's probably going to last. I really want to at least last for like three or four days. And then maybe towards the end of my trip, I'll put my strip lashes on. But for right now, this is going to be okay for at least the beginning. And I did add some, add some curly on the end. So I like how the look came. And like, I really wanted something lightweight. I could like do different styles. I could do a ponytail, I could do it to the side. I could wear it down the middle. So like, I'm not, and I'm not a middle part braids type of girl. I'm probably gonna wear it to the side today. But yeah, this is how my hair came out. I really like it. I did get my eyebrows on too. But I was gonna film in there, but I didn't like that vibe. So I went in there and she was like, you got a mask? I was like, no, do you, do you have a mask that I could wear? For a dollar, like kind of like what an ass for real. What? I still got my eyebrows done. They, she did a good job. But girl, don't come at me like that. I also got my toes done. Well, I got a pedicure because y'all, it was a tragedy, an actual tragedy on my feet. So I got my toes done. So today, all I gotta do is get my nails done. So. I think I want like actually let me get my phone so I can show y'all what I want. Alright, so what I have on my list of things I need to get last minute from the store today is a crop top white t-shirt. So I have this orange skirt. It's kind of like a um more athletic looking kind of skirt I have from Target. And I want to wear it, but if I can't find the shirt to match it, I'm not even gonna take it. A gold dowel soap bar. I'm a bar soap type of girl. I don't really do body washes like that. Well, when I have really, 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 really dry skin, I've had eczema my whole life. And I like, I go through spurts of like it being out of control and, it, and me having out of control. So, for me not having to try to rectify the situation, which right now I'm kind of having a smile, like, smiled eczema outbreak, like on the back of my thighs. Like, I think it's for me, like, wearing shorts all the time and, like, sitting places. And it's just, like, being irritated. And then I scratch it. And then it turns to eczema. So, that's what I think. So, I'm trying to, like, combat that right now. So, I'm not using any kind of, like, fragrance to anything at the moment. So, I need a gold bar soap. I do use the white one sometimes. I feel like the gold one is just, the gold one is just, like, way more, way better for me. Then, we have a travel size toothpaste. I bought a toothpaste. And it's not the right size. It's like four ounces. I need to be 3.3 ounces. It's 3.4 for, for travel size, right? So, whatever. I need that. And I'm picky about my toothpaste. I like Sensodyne or I like knockoffs of Sensodyne. So, like the Equate one or what's the other one called? Um, the Walmart brand. Either way. Sensodyne or 
a sister that I do. And some cotton rounds because did y'all see the TikTok where she blew into the cotton round? She put like the my micellar water on there and she, she blew it on the cotton round and it like turned into a foam. Like, girl, what? What? Nobody told me that. So I need to get some cotton rounds and I was gonna buy some, but they like three dollars at Walmart, three dollars at Target, like so I'm gonna go to Dollar Tree and get some kind of rounds. I'm trying to strategically pack all my stuff in a carry-on and like a personal item. So it's going good, but I will say that my man is bringing like a lot of my stuff with him, not a lot, but maybe like five or six things of, the, of like my, my clothes from his, from him. So they're not having to fit in my luggage. So I don't know how I'm gonna bring it back. That's the problem. But I didn't film packing or anything. So, I just, I didn't. But, I'm about to eat some of this mac. I think I'm going to eat half of it, and then when I get back, I'll eat the other half, maybe. But I'm just going to eat a little of this right now. I'm just not trying to be starving out here. Actually, ugh, ain't no more meat, though. I'm just going to eat all of it. Fuck it. I ain't got no meat or nothing. This mac and cheese was so good. It was so good. So, okay. Well, I'll call y'all back when I'm, like, about to leave the house. I'm about to sit down and eat this, watch some YouTube videos, probably. And then I'm about to be out of here because I got to get my nails on. Yeah, my granddaddy brought, like, a bologna. If, you, if you're not country or you're not, like, from the South or whatever, you probably don't even eat bologna. But my granddaddy grew some bologna this morning. So good, it's so good. Y'all gonna say it's some country ghetto ass shit, but fried bologna. So I don't even know where I'm going. Well, I'm trying to find a nail shop because these nails I got done in Brooklyn, but now I'm in Memphis, so I have to find a nail shop in Memphis. So I'm in South Haven, and I'm gonna go ahead and go to Dunkin' because I feel like I'm feeling anxious because I don't want to the fuck on my nails. So I'm gonna get a Dunkin'. I'm gonna get a Dunkin'. Cause I need it to like make me happy right now and I'm gonna go try this nail shop that I see over here I just rolled past one but I don't know what to give me I'm like, it wasn't giving so I'm gonna leave I'm going to Duncan and then I'm going to another nail shop so. I hope it's not shaking are y'all shaking I don't know. can I get a um, small iced coffee caramel and cream that's all. Okay. <sighs> Let's do a taste test. See the heating? Or not? It's the best part of the day. Mix it up because it's a little part. It's okay. Not enough cream in it, but whatever. Y'all, I have to show y'all these frames because, like, what? Like, like I, I, I can't buy all these. See the frames? Like, what? Okay, these ones I'm choosing from. Really, I need a pair of black ones. I need a pair of black ones. But these clear, the clear, I think the clear is like a go, but then these look rich. Like, these look, these look expensive. Like, they lined in white. these right they're gray looking color but fire like fire but then they also have these these also look expensive they give them like in a winter circle frames so it's either the cir these circles which i think i'm feeling more of these these just look more i don't know these or these I 
feel like that the white lining is fire. The white lining is fire. <sighs> okay. I think I might get the, the circles. Because I feel like these are more out of everything I have. This is like I have no I have nothing like this one. So I'm thinking like circles. They give a rich girl, rich vibes. I wish it was white line like these. But they're not. I could get both. I could get both. But I like I don't need two pairs. I really just need like one pair of black shades because I don't have any black ones. I got like most of them black outfits. What y'all think? Leave me in the comments. The circle. Leave a circle. I mean, say one for the circles. Two for the white one. Even though I'm already have to buy it now, I want to know what y'all think. I think for the second me just needing like a plain black pair, I should get. y'all it really was a hassle to get here the flight i flew allegiant if you, if you know what that is it's giving spirit it's giving frontier but worse it wouldn't give you no water so i'm not really wasn't really feeling it then i got an uber to the airport from here i'm not gonna walk i got an uber from the airport to here the first uber was bullshit so i had to cancel on him I got another one that pulled up right away. So, yeah, we're on our way to walk to go get some food. And it's at a place called American Social. So we're gonna see if it's good or not. I never tried it. I never stayed in this area. We're staying, we staying at like Brickell downtown. And it's actually really cute. I mean, it's giving downtown, you think? It looks like a general downtown. But it's more like stuff that way. Like big buildings, whatever, but so. I'll let y'all know we get to the restaurant. Hopefully it's good because I'm starving. One out of twelve. I mean, out of 10. twelve out of ten. Starving. So hopefully it's good. If it's not, I'm gonna cry. Over there, pizza. So I'll call y'all when we get there. I'll call y'all back. Now you won't know my time, eh? Nine point five. Nine point five. He gave it nine point five. I give it an eight point five. Like it was really good, but I got heartburn really fast. So I'm an old lady. They not here yet. It's such a beautiful scenery right here. Let's see them you with the palm trees. We went on our Uber to go back to the hotel. I really wish I could go find like some Tom's, cause like girl. I get that I'm old and everything, but like, I shouldn't be having these problems like this. Like, as soon as I drank that tequila, I immediately got like heartburn indigestion. I don't know if it's heartburn or indigestion, but like, I think it's to. I just sipped in some water. I think it's tequila that's, that's doing that to me. And I hate that for myself. We made it back to the hotel. And I stopped it. You hear the background? Shh, 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 shh. So I got a water from the Dead Sea. Oh, don't don't buy this kind of stuff at hotels. This is like three dollars for water, but I needed it because I can't like 
I need some tongs. It's not okay. But I just want to tell y'all good night. I'm in this vlog here because tomorrow we actually get on the boat and I'm like gonna start it from a fresh one. So I hope y'all have a good night. Cause I'm definitely gonna have a good night. I already been having a good night actually. Listen, I had a microwave. Is it here? The food was so good. So I said I was going to end it. But I'm going to tell you about the food. Why is it like not focusing on me? So we ordered the mahi sandwich and the truffle fries. And he had the steak sandwich with like the Wagyu milk. It was so good. But y'all, I can't. I don't know. It's like it was too much meat. You, I mean, do you feel like that? Like it was just heavy? Like it was too heavy for me. Like for something I like to eat. I like the fish sandwich better. Okay. I enjoyed the fish sandwich more. The steak melt was really good. Like, it tastes better, but I put, I couldn't eat it like that. I took one bite and that was enough. That nigga love you, though. So. But the food's good. If you are ever in the Brickle area, it's called American Social. I'm pretty sure, yeah. American Social Bar and Kitchen. They have a really good menu. Like, everything on the menu sounds good. They have some buffalo chicken fries. Like, we should have got those. But that really would have had my... That really would have had me with heartburn right now. So never mind. I don't need that. Good morning. It's a new day. Here, Karen. Good morning. So we late as hell trying to get out of this. Trying to get out of this hotel. The boat does not actually leave until two o'clock. So we're gonna go get breakfast. And uh, yeah, I'll show you my outfit. Actually, I have to show y'all somewhere else. Just like packing up our stuff. I don't. Just like packing up our stuff to try to get out of here, and it gets really. I think I was 11. It's like 11:20, so in the next 10 minutes we need to be out of here. And I don't know where we're gonna get breakfast at yet. I think we might just get the hotel breakfast. That's just the easiest. That's the easiest thing to do right now. But I know it's like a lot of breakfast places around here. Oh, it's a Ross down there. Can we give them our? We can give them our luggage. They should be able to hold it, right? The hotel. They normally hold people's stuff. I'm asking because I want to go down to Ross for and Shades. It's right across the street. Went in like the little, they have like a little market, like a bunch of places, like a little shops or whatever. Here in downtown Miami, and we're still waiting the boat. We're left our luggage at the hotel, so we have to go back and get it. And we don't board the ship to 2:45, so we got a little time. Let's be here. I'm kind of hungry. And then I kind of want to wait. I'm hungry, but I want to wait <laughs> to get on the boat. But we're not actually get on the boat good until like after three o'clock. So like we could get something light. But we might can get something in the hotel. So let's see. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit since it's like a good mirror. But the set is from Amazon. It's linked in my bio. It's so cute. Like, it's like a split side. Barking shorts underneath. It's so cute. I think I'm going to get in some more colors. And this bag is from Target. The shoes are from JCPenney. But they have like a pair that looks just like these. They have a pair that looks just like these at Target as well. So, we're going to go ahead and on the boat now. Make sure you come to my next vlog to see the actual cruise. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Thank you.